Did you know that if the internal SSD on your M1 or M2 Mac fails or becomes corrupt, you won't be able to boot off an external SSD backup system drive? When you try to boot off an external SSD, the Mac checks one TR partition on the internal SSD first which enables the Mac to boot off the external SSD. But, if the internal SSD has failed or becomes corrupt, it won't be able to boot off an external SSD, leaving you with a brick Mac. So, what can you do if your internal SSD fails or becomes corrupt? First try using Mac OS recovery mode. If that doesn't work, take your Mac to an Apple store. In some cases, they may need to replace the entire SSD or worse the logic board, which can be a very costly repair. Another good reason to have an Apple Care plan. It's always a good idea to back up your data regularly. It's also not a bad idea to keep that older Mac around if it can still run the latest Mac OS or a second backup Apple Silicon Mac so you can keep working. SSDs can last for years without issues, but one day they will eventually fail. I hope you found this information helpful. Please like and sub to my channel, and I will see you on the next Mac Sound Solutions video.